Yeah, what's up? I already got the results of the testosterone test. Okay, here it is. About a year ago, wow, maybe it's more. Been that long? <laughs> yeah. In fact, I was wondering whatever happened to this bit. About a year ago, we had a spit in a bunch of cups. Right. All right. This is when Jackie was with the show. So um, we spit in these cups, and this guy, a Harvard guy, was doing a study. He could analyze spit. I hate that word. It's disgusting. But he can analyze it. Saliva. Saliva. Thank you. He can analyze saliva and uh, tell you who has the most testosterone. In fact, Robin even oh. I spit. salivated. <laughs> Let me see if I get Terry on the phone. Terry, you're the Harvard guy? Terry. Hello, hi. Yeah, you're the Harvard guy, right? Exactly. Okay. Well, these are slow results, Terry. Yeah, dude, what happened? <laughs> well, it looks like Howard is whoa, the main... Whoa, whoa. Wait, no, no, oh. not the results. Oh, not the you results. blew the bit. You blew the bit, Terry. We didn't know the answer. We were yeah, going to bet. I can see why it took so long. He doesn't even answer questions properly. We just want to know why it took so long to find... Ah, oh, God oh. damn it. Oh. Dude, we didn't know the result. Oh. We wanted to bet on it. You blew the bit. Man, you're not a funny guy, I'll tell you that. <laughs> well, okay. I won? You did win, Howard. <laughs> you can still bet on the other people. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> That'll be fun. I knew I had the most testosterone on this show. I well, knew it. I knew you had more than me. <laughs> yeah, you, you, you were not in the running, but I knew all of you. Wimps. Wimps. <laughs> Casey go run out of the building during the World uh, Trade Center attack. A, he's got less testosterone than me, probably. Did you spit, Casey? Yeah, Robin's got uh, 65 units. Like, the average woman is 85. Right. Um, the so next she's one. low. 65? Yeah, she got 65. The next What one, does that mean, Doc? Well, high t people with a lot of testosterone are different than people with less testosterone in important ways like... Uh, Sexual activity, um, body type, so high testosterone people are more muscular, they're hairier, they're more sexually active. God, I'm sexually active. Yes, you yeah. obviously have the highest testosterone. I really do. <laughs> I, I got a boner 24-7. Something wrong with me. Casey, what was Casey? Well, I'll go, up, I'll go up this way. All right, so you got the average woman is, is 85. Next, with 199, is John. Boy, wait, wait, give me the result. What the? I don't even know what you're talking about, you right. marble mouth, mush face. Jesus Christ. All right, let me see. Yeah. I got the, All right, here it is. Howard Stern had what the most. What did you have? Okay. What was your level? What is the highest? I see here 0 to 600. Is that right, Doc? Yeah, see, the average man is 300, and you're almost twice the average, Howard. I'm 600? I was 544. Wow. What's Christ. that mean, Doc? Am I some sort of Superman? Uh, it means you're a very high testosterone guy. Lots of good things come along with that. High status. Like I said, lots of sexuality. Go ahead. Better mood. Oh, well, that didn't uh, It happened there. Most times, but <laughs> what not happened this there? time. <laughs> Great, I'm going to have a heart attack we for were, my good we mood. We were with you up until the mood. <laughs> Go ahead, what else? Well, the only bad news is high testosterone men die younger than oh. low testosterone men. Believe me, that ain't that isn't such a bad <laughs> thing. But, you know, the other day I was reading that men with very long—I mean, people with long legs—live longer. So they do. You, you might be balanced out. I gotta tell you, something, I never see anybody with long legs li old. I never see tall old people. That's They're true. all tiny. I don't they shrink, that. don't they? I'm telling you, but they must put them they somewhere. Shrink. They stick them with the homeless. <laughs> they shrink when they get old. Guess who had? The, who is the second most testosterone? Gary. No. Vinny Favali. Ew. Oh, 368. He doesn't look manly at all. By the way, I, I nearly doubled him. Yeah. Right, <laughs> right, Doc? Absolutely. What's your testosterone level, Doc? Uh, mine is around 450. Oh, yeah. yeah. Sure, yeah. Sure, this sure, is sure. favor. This is yeah. Pia. <laughs> Gary Delabate was third with 328. Ooh, Gary. And Gary's fam. So that's a little bit over the average man. The no, average we... man is 302. So Vinny, Howard, and Gary are over the average. Under the average, KC's got 301. <laughs> oh, well, that's still higher than I thought it would be. Uh, Fred's got 202. <laughs> what? I'm wearing a dress right now. I'm shocked, Fred. He <laughs> drives a motorcycle. Shopping, Fred. <laughs> I think that's why he got the motorcycle, make him seem a little more manly. Right, <laughs> and the lowest is Stuttering John, 199. Hey, can I ask you a uh, question, doctor? Is it because sure. is it because I because I didn't really spit too much saliva? Oh, yeah. get out, John! No, it, it's a concentration, so it doesn't matter how much you spit. You know what, Howard? But it is weird because I think Fred and I are only only two guys in the show that don't have hair in our chest. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. And Casey's a little low. You don't have much. Yeah, no, hair. I, I don't. I don't have a hairy chest. Yeah. I'm Does not a hairy. Does guy. that have anything to do with it? Gary's a yeah. part ape. Testosterone oh. makes you hairy. What would Ronnie score? Ronnie would be off, off the scale. 900, right? Uh, 10, 10 million. <laughs> He's so hairy. He's the hairiest man I've hairiest ever seen. What did Jackie fall on there? 
Uh, I don't see Jackie on. Oh, I see. Uh, is no, Jackie? no, no, he's not on there. How come he didn't spit? I don't think he was here then. No, he wasn't uh, here that day. He uh, was in here that day. Yeah. Uh, oh, okay. Vinny was here. Uh, Vinny was in, uh, right? Yeah, yeah. Am I on there? Uh, no. <laughs> Somebody's spit. crossed out. That's that was a woman that was with uh, the doctor. Yeah, oh yeah. Okay. Are you spit? Ben, Robin, spit. you've got sixty-five. The average Jeez. woman is eighty-five. You got your low. I gotta low. go get some uh, testosterone. Yeah. How do we get more testosterone? Yeah, we need you being more aggressive. <laughs> Uh, me? Yeah. <laughs> With so little testosterone, how did I get so aggressive? Did you all charged up? <laughs> Let me ask Lord. you something, Doc. When someone's low on testosterone, right away you start thinking gay and all that kind of stuff. Is, 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 are they gay? Are Fred and John gay? Um, they, they might be, but not nothing about testosterone relates to sexuality in men. Right. Yeah, I was going to say, I bet you a bunch of gay Actually, guys have a lot so of testosterone. Yeah, mean? gay guys have so the most it, testosterone. So what does it mean? Yeah. Just that we're more, uh, we have more leadership qualities? Yeah, high social status, uh, I said good sexuality. You're also more willing to get into fights. So if somebody confronts a high testosterone person, a high T male will not back down. How do you... Uh, well, yeah. well, then this that is, ain't me. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, how, you are really, <laughs> you know, going away from the... <laughs> how do you... Um, <laughs> not, not just, not I'm, just, I'm noticing that my testosterone level is extremely high. Yes. Uh, is, that, you, is that bad? Have you tested anyone as high as this? Uh, of the people that I've tested, you're the highest. I am. Really? Yes. <laughs> and Howard, he was. But who have you tested? And 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 and, and I, so I would have to be in the top what one percent? Uh, you'd probably be in the top few percent. Yep. Yeah. Wow. Are yep. you impressed with my score? <laughs> do you want to do a study on me? <laughs> I might. I yeah. might. Do you want to single him out for uh, special study? Well, I'd you like, like to your... dissect me. <laughs> 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 you better will your body to science. Yes, I'm very, very testosterone filled. I knew but I would if win. If you're low on testosterone, should you do something about it? Well, they do have patches now. You can buy. <laughs> For, for, for men, you have to strap them onto the scrotum. That's where they... they... <laughs> do you live longer by... Let me tell you something, boys. <laughs> Until you've had a lot of testosterone in your system... Don't yeah. know what it's You like. don't know what it's like. And let me tell you something. I'd get the, I'd get the scrotum patch. <laughs> do you live Casey? longer if you have lower testosterone? No, you actually live lo less. If you have... If you have a lot of testosterone. Yeah. You live less, so then yeah. I'll live longer. But yeah, you live like well. a woman. Yeah. Yeah, but of course, you know how women always uh, live longer than their husbands? <laughs> That's right. fine. Yeah, you will live to like, you'll be an old bitty, like 150 years old in a house somewhere. But John, that has to be in conjunction with proper weight control and exercise and stuff. Yeah, right. Is it normal for, is it normal for a high testosterone guy to, to uh, run away from a sweater lying in the woods? <laughs> <laughs> that was a ski parker, you. Oh, I'm sorry. Ski parkers are very scary. Hey, I gotta go, but uh, thanks. Terry, thanks, man. Appreciate it. All right, later, brother. Thanks for doing this yeah, I study. Think he's working on some master's thesis or something, yeah. doctorate yeah. or something. Hey, Howard. He's over at Harvard. You know what they do? You get tons of grant money if right. you come up with some whacked out study. Yeah. And uh, this guy's probably a multimillionaire now. Right, from, Terry? From studying. Doing all right. Yeah. See? Yeah. All right, Terry, later. Uh, thanks a lot. Bye bye. That's Terry. But that's funny. The football player over there, very low testosterone. Yeah, KC. <laughs> what is it, Baba Fu High? There's uh, two people from the WWF that are here that are going to present you with an Xbox. Ooh. You're kidding. Who's here from the W? I don't know anyone in the Tor WWE. Tori, um... Let me see. Tori is Wilson? Is that her name? And, uh, and is she hot? She's cute. Let me put on my cute. sunglasses. And, I'll look at And DDP? It. Who's DDP? Uh, you know, I, I wrote down what it stands for. Dallas, Diamond, Diamond something. Dallas Page. Diamond Dallas Page? Diamond Dallas Page is here? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> right, let me put on my uh, sunglasses. So Why, I, we'd yeah. know them anyway. So let I look good on camera. Let me put on my glad rag. <laughs> uh, how do I look now, Robin? You look very handsome. In fact, the other day, and, and you've been looking very handsome. Why are you having Tony do your hair? You walk in looking great. I do, and then w it looks better before, right? Well, it looks better all the time, but I'm just you saying know why? you look fine when you walk in. Because Tony gave me a haircut I can do myself. Oh. She did good. Yes, she yeah, did. Yes, she did. I only let Tony cut my hair now. Because that's what I said to myself. I said, why is he having Tony? He <coughs> Excuse me. Hot chick in the room. Oh, oh sorry. Mm. <laughs> Honey, have you heard about my testosterone level? <laughs> it's higher than Diamond Dallas Page. Wow. As high, as strong, wow. and as masculine as you think <laughs> Diamond Dallas Page is, Tori. Howard Stern could beat him in testosterone level. Just remember that. Uh, I, uh, okay, I believe you. Have you ever slept with a man who has an, an unusually large testosterone accumulation in his body? <laughs> Do you know what it's like? Do you have any clue? what it's like to sleep with someone like myself who tests, and I'll show you the test. <laughs> <laughs> I have 544 level of testosterone out of 600. Good according God. to Harvard wow. Research, according to Harvard Research, there isn't a person on the planet that goes this high. Wow. I was going to say, your SATs weren't very high. Are you my, on steroids? Your testosterone. No. Steroids, no. 
Look at me. Do, am I on steroids? <laughs> I'm a pencil neck geek. <laughs> my testosterone is so high that if you had sex with me, you'd probably have the best sex of your life. That's all I'm saying. Or you might not last very long because what? your level is so high. You but just then we'd go it. again. Uh, uh, you'd have true. multiple okay. sex. <laughs> and again, and again. Uh, I don't mean to uh, ignore DDP, but I'm a man and I can see Tori is wearing a belly shirt, a pink belly shirt, and little, little tiny, what are those, Frankie B jeans? Um, lucky jeans. Let me ask you what girls are up lucky. to these days. Yeah. Lucky for me. We're very lucky. <laughs> can I ask you a question? Uh, is the goal now with jeans to wear them so low that almost your pubic bone shows? No, that's too low because then you sit down and your butt crack hangs out. What, those pants are designed to show maximum belly. Without butt, butt crack. crack. Without butt crack. Right. That's, not, that's not a bad thing. <laughs> can we see you sit down? There's a ratio. I believe that if you sat down, we would see your butt crack. Really? If I bent over really far, yeah. probably. Let's really? Those are... F- yeah, let's sit. Let's, do you want us to test <laughs> it? A test sit? Yeah, a test sit. I'm, I'm, I'm bent over. Looking at you, yeah. I'm in <laughs> extreme heat, but should I waste my time being in heat? Are you a married woman? I just got engaged two days ago. Oh. Uh, all right, let's talk to DDP. We should, we should have booked her on Monday. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what scumbags you get engaged? Yeah, who's, who's the, who's the oh. skunk that stole you from me? <laughs> He's very sweet. He is, really? Yes. Who is the guy? Is he a wrestler? He is. Of course. What's his name? He'll kick my ass. His name is Billy Kidman. Billy Kidman. That oh, jerk? Tori, you are exciting. DDP, do you dream of a woman like Tori for yourself? Actually, I got a pretty fine lady myself. Oh, you do? She yeah. is fine. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, she is. Her name's Kimberly. As fine as this Tori Wilson? She's been in a couple issues of uh, Playboy, the uh, specialty issues. So. Oh, really? Yeah, but uh, she also, she also has her master's. DDP is going, uh, doing all right. <laughs> She's got a master's from Northwestern, too. No kidding. Yeah, Playboy yeah. and yeah. a master's. In what? I'm very, 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 very lucky. Wow. Uh, in marketing, as a matter of fact. Okay. Tori, DDP, she took it at 22, so that's hey, pretty DDP, no, no offense, but how, how'd you get the chick with the masters in Playboy? I, yeah. bro, I don't know. Why? Well, he's a nice guy. He's got he a big physique. Her. <laughs> See, women dig big guys, man. Guys who can handle yeah, themselves. Yeah, they say they don't, Stupid. but they, No, the, mas- the masters think through me. What do you mean? The ma- what are you saying? He's an idiot? No, 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 but the chicks with masters. Because well, he wrestles, he's an idiot? I didn't no, say that. But, but, that's what you're trying to yeah, say. Dallas, what's he saying, man? <laughs> I don't know Dallas. what he's saying. But, Dallas, the guy's trying to say that you're stupid and you don't deserve a girl with a masters. Get in there, Dallas. I guess. That's not exactly a bad thing. Why? That's a good thing. Well, I, hey, <laughs> because I got her. You're insulting the man. Okay, I apologize. I'm That's Dallas better. This right. is Papa Bowie tonight on the Omni. <laughs> Tori, Tori, uh, you are one smoking hot chick. She's hot as what do you do for the WWE? I, who cares? I think she's done. Have you done lingerie matches? Yes, I was just in a lingerie match with Stacy oh. Keebler. She came in to see you. Oh my! Stacy's hot too. Yeah, she's the two of you wrestled, hot. and who won that match? I did. Thank you very wow. much. Very provocative uh, positioning. Here, were so. you in your bra and panties at the end of the? Uh, I was. You were from the beginning to the end. Really? Mm-hmm. And what did you take off of Stacy in that match? Nothing. We started off in our lingerie. <laughs> you did? Mm-hmm. Oh, you just wrestled in lingerie. So how did we know who won? Yeah, who cares I who won? I pinned her. You did pin her. Yeah. Now, Robin, we all won. <laughs> Whoever was there won. Baby, aren't you a little too young <laughs> to be getting married? I mean, how old are you? If you don't 26. Mind? You're 26 and you're getting married? Uh, Baby, that ain't going to uh, last. That's old. Do you, wanna... you know how long life is? You have no idea, do you? <laughs> Come on. Honey. It's not going to work out. <laughs> I you gotta... knew you were going to say that. You have so much more banging to do. Oh, she does. How many men has she been with so far? Yeah, how many men you been with? Seriously. Uh, let's see, nine. Nine, nine. guys. Mm-hmm. That's it. Let's make it double figures. That- Come on, <laughs> before marriage. In ten years, you're gonna say to yourself, "I could have like banged this guy." No way. Could have banged Howard. Nah. Don't you? Do you get hit on by famous people being in WWE? Do you ever get celebrities come up to you and talk to you and stuff? No. Really? <laughs> well, let Howard start that. <laughs> we worked on you a little bit. Thanks. Now, Never DDP. Met sink or anybody? DDP. <laughs> yeah, everyone wants. It. Their testosterone level is uh, really high. Well, you got somebody. What you? You don't really know how to wrestle or anything. What you? What you do is uh, you're just a hot chick, right? I kind of know how to wrestle. You do. I'm learning. Good Lord, you look smoking. <laughs> you want me to teach you how to wrestle? Yeah, oh yeah later. Yeah, Not on the air. Let her pin you. Hey, Howard, could you could you beat her at an arm wrestling match? Who? You? Could you beat? Uh, how the hell do Tori? I know? I don't know. Were you on <laughs> no. juice or anything? No. No? No. Why, you want to arm wrestle me? Yeah. Wow. You do? Heck yeah. She'll probably kick my ass. Scared? Uh, yeah. You know, no, no, you have all that testosterone. Yes. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> hey, don't you real that, boobs? Uh, no. I mean DDP, not you. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, they're really mine. <laughs> Yeah, one smoking chick. Hey, you know, I auditioned for your um, TV show. You did? Mm-hmm. What, what part? BJ. You did? Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Good Lord.
Lord, what the hell went wrong? <laughs> did you see I her? must have really sucked in my audition. <laughs> you must have. I um the problem is you didn't. Oh, oh! There you go. <laughs> yeah. Come on, honey. Get with it. It's a showbiz, baby. Man, you would have made a great BJ. I think BJ's going to get a sister. Yeah, BJ's sister. <laughs> I'll talk to you about that off the air in a private room. Yeah. yeah. There's a good way for you to get on that show. It's funny. Uh, you, last night, I had the ultimate Hollywood experience. What? Uh, Son of the Beach is going into its third season. Uh-huh. Love that and we ha- Thank you. And we have a new character. Porcelain Bidet is oh, the new one. She's a new girl on the show, Porcelain Bidet. And we're casting for Porcelain Bidet. So we, uh, there's a bunch of women that uh, they auditioned. So they have to send me the tapes of the auditions. Oh, you got those? And they're all in bikinis. Uh-huh. And I get to sit there and watch the friggin' audition. Sweet. It's so sweet. You don't sweet. invite guys <laughs> what The sweeter damn. move is, which I normally would do, but I'm too afraid to fly, is I would go to California and sit in on the auditions. Live and in person. You know, and sit there and act like I know something. Yeah. And then the girls would be turned on. <laughs> That's like when I did that audition with Clooney Man. He yeah. had that going on with the chicks walking in. Yeah. Oh, yeah. God. Oh, it's that, such a cool move. Oh, it's, re- it's a scam, and man. And you wouldn't oh. get on a plane just to have that. Hell no. <laughs> yeah. Who knows what you could get those girls to do? You're not kidding, right? <laughs> right, DDP? Hey, I've been listening to you forever. I'm sure you're getting wild. <laughs> you're not kidding. No, but uh, did you audition for me in front of me? No, in L.A., on tape. On tape, yeah. Oh. I probably saw your tape. One of those, yeah. I wasn't in a bikini, though. That's why he doesn't. Maybe so, that's yeah, it. he never saw it. What were you thinking? You know, let me see. I know. You, you, we got any, let me put you in a bikini now. Let me look you over. You might be right for this role. <laughs> I got, I got it right clothes. there if you want to just pick one out. Let me see how you yeah, look. Go ahead, Tori. Go get one of them. Yeah, go ahead, Tori. You need I'm to be in the Just one. Hey, right here. Come on. There you Come go. On. That's okay, really. Yeah. I already have a job now. Nah, that job is so good. DDP said, will tell you to go be on Son of the Beach. Hey, Son of the Beach is a hell of a show. It's a good show. <laughs> it is. I love it. So you auditioned and you didn't get it. Yeah. Yeah, but I tell you, though, sitting there watching those audition tapes, I felt like an important guy. It was the greatest freaking thing. Okay, now I'm going to watch my audition tape. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, um, and my girlfriend came over and go, I need to watch some audition tapes. And I, but I act all bummed out. I go, oh, I got to watch audition tapes. Did you see anybody that you really dug? And do you like save the tapes or you just give them back? No, no, no. I, I, I mean, I, I'm, I'm not so perverted. I'm going to sit there and, you know, whack, a, whack one off to it. I, um, no, I. You're very professional. I was professional in, in watching the tape. But, uh, you know. Does your girlfriend watch with you? She watched it. She was very curious. And um, she actually got a call. To audition, they didn't know that she was my girlfriend, uh-huh. and she got a call to audition, but uh, uh, she didn't go she in didn't on go? it. No, she make her audition. That would be cool. That'd be fun. I should go. She goes, "What? What? Do you want to send me off to L.A. and get rid of me?" I go, "No." It turned into a fight. So I said, um, "Oh no." <laughs> yeah, but the the thing is that you watch the tape, and then like I had my favorite, and she had a favorite, and she actually kind of swayed me in a way. She said, "Look, really? I'll watch this girl. She's really good." You see, but it was fun because I looked like I'm a powerful guy. <laughs> I got tapes. I got audition you tapes. You got testosterone. Yeah. <laughs> and that testosterone started working, and then who knows? It's, it's a great <laughs> aphrodisiac. Right Bada bing. <laughs> and I think it gets women jealous and stuff because uh, I have sure. audition now, tapes. See, you liked one girl. She had to sway you to another yeah, girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's unbelievable. She's got some pull. She's got some pull, yeah. <laughs> oh. She got a lot of pull, baby. <laughs> she got a lot of pull. <laughs> you need some pull. The yeah. girls need to go kiss up to her, right, instead of you? Yeah, baby. Mm. Yeah. Baby, you, look, you look a little tight. <laughs> you have a do any lesbo action? No. Never in your whole Just life? Just in the ring. That's I a lie. I kissed a girl wait, once. Wait, that's about that as book? far as it went. Where did it go? Where'd you, where'd you kiss the girl? Oh, uh, where? <laughs> <laughs> on the mouth? Oh, on the mouth. <laughs> and that's a boring story. In Cleveland? <laughs> DDP's got a good article here. What is this? Oh, this is her with a chick? Close as it gets, you know. Pillow talk with Stacey Keebler. Oh, that's hot. Holy crap. Oh, i got to bring two, you two little sluts <laughs> over to scores. I told you to ask you to go to scores. I know. Stacey I Coleman. know, and I want to go with you guys. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when can you go? You can make it a threesome. There, now, I see. Go when are you available? You're dying to do some lesbian stuff, aren't you, baby? <laughs> you really are, aren't you? How'd you know? Because I know. I can tell. <laughs> you, you can have see a, it in the eyes. Because you have a hot body. And I'm telling you, these girls all want to do lesbians. They do the lesbians. They just need a guy to facilitate it, right, DDP? Hey, man, there's nothing wrong with it. As far as I'm concerned, it's not a bad thing. It's a good thing. Yeah. DDP, have you had that? Have I had lesbian acts? Yeah, have have you had two birds? Yeah, have you been in threesome? (laughs) 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 I don't want to be... (laughs) Yes. With two chicks, right? Hey, don't even go there. Hey, DDP, I had Rebecca (laughs) Romaine Stamos in my apartment naked. Sweet. Yeah. 
I also had John Stamos in my apartment well, naked, but, <laughs> but I didn't look. There's give and take to everything. All right, I was reading uh-huh. something the other day, and they said if you want your wife or girlfriend to be in a threesome... Go ahead. What's the angle? Never what ask her. What you do first is offer her another guy. And then she goes, no, that's gross. And then you go... If she takes you up on it, head for the hills. <laughs> that is such a dangerous thing to do, is offer your, your girl and wife another guy. What if and then there? they said, and don't make it a skeevy guy, make it a good-looking guy. Now, what you do is, here's what you do. Forget, forget <laughs> that advice. They don't advice. even know what they're, they don't even know they're Where'd you read that, Cosmo? I forget. Here's how you get a girl into a threesome, all right? <laughs> Time you up. say to a girl, why don't we go down to scores? This is what you do. Uh-huh. When you go down to scores, and here's the move. Don't pay attention to any of the strippers. Just pay attention to your girlfriend. Uh-huh. The strippers will come over and pay attention to your girlfriend, and you just are bored silly. All you want to do is touch your girlfriend. Now, th- listen to now, me, and it'll is work. definitely acting, right? Yeah. You <laughs> yeah. Th- yeah, of course. <laughs> but this will work. Yeah, because she'll get pissed if you're with strippers, and that'll end, and she'll go, I don't want to be in any threesome. You're into other girls. Right. You don't want and all you do is go, oh, my God, honey, you look so hot. You, these girls are dancing. Just give my girlfriend a dance or whatever you say. Or my wife or whatever uh-huh. the person is. And, uh-huh. ke- and keep concentrating on her. And then she's going to feel secure in the threesome. And let that girl come home with you. And let that girl come home with you. <laughs> I think that's a great game plan. Yeah. Thank you, DDP. <laughs> Let's get on that. Do I know what I'm doing? <laughs> when you got a face like mine, you got to figure out game plan. <laughs> you know what I mean? And no one's coming home that easily. Oh, yeah. Tori, can I kiss your stomach? Oh, I'd love that. Really? Yeah. yeah get Before I get that. married. Are you allowed? <laughs> yeah. Better watch out for I Billy. I hope so. Let me hold your head. I know. It's just, it's, she's got a, an amazing. Uh, and don't ab. let that guy. And don't let that guy impregnate you. Yeah, really. No. Because that'll ruin your abs. No, it won't. Yeah, you don't want it will. She has no clue. <laughs> I have no clue. I won't kiss your belly. You'll probably be disgusted <laughs> by my smelly lips. All right, listen. You are a beautiful woman. Damn. I'm talking to DDP. (laughs) Thank you, honey. Uh, No, seriously, you are a beautiful woman. Have your ovaries removed. Uh There's no reason for you to get pregnant. Don't ruin that body. (laughs) It's beautiful. DDP, you have a beautiful body, too. You know that. Oh, thanks. Yeah, you don't need to come. <laughs> Wait, I have to do. say something really quick. Yeah. Jackie, I think I met Jackie about a year ago yeah. at a mall, and he sent me... Do you have a naked picture of yourself? Yes, I do. You do? Yeah. She's got it in her back pocket. I have it. Seriously, at home. You sent me a whole box of stuff. Yeah. Actually, that's Benji. Jackie's off the show over a year. Oh, really? Yeah, he does have a naked picture of himself, oh. but it was heavily airbrushed. <laughs> um, all right. Let's uh, take a break. When we come back, we have a lot to get to. Wasn't Tori going to bend over? Pick up a dollar? Yeah. Oh, come on. Give me, give me, <laughs> give me the DDP Tori, stretching let's see, Yeah, let's exercise. see if you bend over. What is it? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. She wears the best underwear. What are you wearing? A G-string? my undies, oh. yeah. Oh, that's hot. Holy Christmas. Howard, it's a triangle about one inch, you know, Do around. you wear those undies when you do those lingerie? Yeah, I do. You, can't we see your undies? <laughs> you can see them. I just bent no, over you, like, for you. Can't you, your pants? Because you do it on yeah. WWE. I'll pull them up for you so you can see the sides. Right, let me see. Oh, you are a little <laughs> man. <laughs> oh, man. That's a good thing. Can we have sex That's with a you? Good thing. <laughs> <laughs> Virtual sex. How soon, does he coming stay soon. faithful when all these pretty girls are running around showing their underwear? Well, you guys are always on the road, right? Well, you're on the road with her, right? We, we live on the road. Really? We pretty much go from They probably year. all bang each other. Uh, exactly. Don't talk You'll about never get it. the real yeah. story. Yeah. DDP's probably doing her in the back room. <laughs> nah, I go in there. You've already seen those underwear. <laughs> He's like, those underwear? We've all had those. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. In fact, uh, here's a picture. Here's a picture of DDP's hot wife. Let all me right. take a look. Let me see what's doing. This girl's got a, oh, oh my yeah. God. Look oh, at the yeah. melons on your wife. <laughs> oh, she's got a master's degree. DDP, those aren't real, are they? Yeah, they are to me. Really? <laughs> you, you got such big masculine hands. If you squeeze those things, they'll burst. Oh my I've God. tried, and uh, that ain't <laughs> happened yet. <laughs> Is she a double D? <laughs> Uh, it's pretty, yeah. She's double DDP. <laughs> and she gets she got a go- and she got a gorgeous pumpkin butt too on top of Oh, that. pumpkin oh, butt. She <laughs> does have a nice butt. Tori, you probably don't have a nice butt. No. Yeah. Why don't you show us and we'll see if it's pumpkin. It's not very nice. It, hers is way better. Man, DDP, you got some wife over there. Yeah, I'm a lucky guy. Some yeah. wife. Come Look at this. How about passing the luck around a little bit? Yeah, hey, I'll spread it around. Yeah. 
Whatever goes around comes around. What do you around. mean pumpkin butt? Is there butt orange? No, actually, it's got this <laughs> unbelievable sweet bubble to it. Really? I mean, it's nice. tremendous. I'm he a big... was in love. How long have you been married? I've been married 10 years to someone. Really? Wow. And you're still in love? I got her as a baby. I was in a nightclub business in Southwest Florida when I was making the move. How old was she, 15? Uh, actually, at the time, she was like uh, 19. 19. <laughs> yeah. Nice. Right. How old were you? He was 53. <laughs> <laughs> hey, actually, I'm 45, bro. Really? Yeah. How old is your wife now? Uh, 29. Yeah, see, that's the right spread. That's the right spread. It's, it's, it's a good work in the middle. Of course. Of course. You know what you're doing. You got any kids? No. They yeah, don't ruin that thing. Exactly. Have kids with some other woman. There you go. I try to talk, I try to talk her into that at one point. Yeah. Impregnate Tori and then keep your wife nice and tight. Oh, pumpkin butt. Oh, my <laughs> Do you call her pumpkin butt? Of course. Oh, that's nice. Come here, pumpkin butt. Come here, pumpkin butt. Come here, pumpkin butt. Come here, pumpkin butt. We're going to have some fun. <laughs> it's got to be a little more discreet than that, but it's I close to that. I just came back from the road. That's right. I've been on the road with an Xbox. You're going to get it tonight. <laughs> Good God. I'm going to get you in a trifecta. I had to go to those stupid radio stations with the yeah. Xbox. I was just up talking to them Jews in New York. I need some loving. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tori, pull your pants down. Come on! Come on, baby. I try to light her up like a pinball machine when I get off the road, but uh, oh, you I know with all the testosterone flight in your body right now. You're not kidding. Tori, how come? Yeah. You, you get in your lingerie on the uh, WWE. Show us your panties. You guys already uh, saw it. Please. You, you, Tori, it. you know what? We didn't see it. It would be an amazing commercial for this Sunday's for this Sunday's thing. Uh, this, 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 if you do it, we'll talk series. about it all day today and all day tomorrow. I mean, and the WWE people are out there going, Tori, do it for God's sake. How yeah. about the yeah. company? Then, be then, be, yeah. be a player. Yeah. Right. But then I would no longer be engaged. Vince won't fire you when you get a, when you hit the wall a little What's bit. If you how, could you not get, how could you not be engaged for what you're going to do Sunday and night anyway? Come on! Let's do it, honey! It for him. <laughs> Don't you start pissing <laughs> off the city folk. We want to see some panties. Oh my God. Howard will be talking about Survivor Series this Sunday all week for the rest of the day. Oh, come on, Tori. Oh, you guys. Oh, what is the big deal? Are you like on the Howard this, Stern Show, honey? Honey, this, this if you look, Tori, if you don't do it, the terrorists have already won. Oh, goodness <laughs> This isn't going to air till after Sunday anyway. Yeah, so, yeah. So it's not like we're going to cut into your action for Sunday night. Yeah, we're it's just an ass in. shot. You, you got a great oh, ass. You got a great 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 ass, You go in the gym, you work you work on that ass for a reason, so that we like it. It's awesome. Honey, show My mother is still alive, and she would kill me. She's going to watch Sunday night. You're doing lingerie wrestling matches. Your mother likes it. In five years, that, that, that whole body's going to fall apart. i got to save it so people will buy the next pay-per-view. Oh, uh, please, I'm dying. Make a dying man happy, honey. <laughs> I got uh, a head egg over here. Come on. <laughs> it's just like right. going to the beach. What's Daddy, the give up. Yes. She ain't going I know. I'm, I'm chipping away at that wall. Uh, yeah. He's good at it, He's though. He's wonderful. Mm -hmm, he is. He's very good. So you're going to do it, Tori? No. Thanks, Paige. Oh. You're my backup. Yeah, Paige, take off your pants. Somebody <laughs> show us some pumpkin ass. Let's see it, honey. Let's see that pumpkin. Let's make a Jack O' Lantern, baby. <laughs> make that pumpkin smile. Let's see some pumpkin pie. <laughs> Maybe she'll do it on Raw this Monday. You well, you're you not are. listening to Diamond Dallas. He's gonna get mad. Yeah. Vince McMahon just faxed us. He says you have to take your pants off. All right. All right listen, uh, Tori, great seeing you. Tori Wilson and uh, DDP Diamond Dallas Page, great seeing you, yeah, and good luck. You, and we'll be back right after these words. Tori, guys, what was going on? I'm trying to get my clothes off. Tori, imagine that. I can't imagine. Tori, why? Why wouldn't you do it? Wait here a second, guys. Why wouldn't you do it? Because, for one, I just got engaged three days ago, and I was warned before I came onto the show. <laughs> what, what, how were you warned? What did they tell you? What did he tell you? Um, if I wanted to stay engaged, that I would keep my clothes on. But he knows I would have taken care of you. I know he's in the back there. I would have been fine. Dallas, you think I, didn't should... see, I didn't see it as a bad thing. I saw it as a good thing. You think I she should have done it? I got to save something for I marriage. I've got a question. <laughs> well, Look at that body. You kidding me? You kidding me? Would have uh, been beautiful. Are you, are you regretting now that you didn't do it? No. It's actually, she got a big <laughs> uh, sigh of relief. She walked in, she went, oh, thank God. You made you famous. Yeah. <laughs> we can't, and we can't get you to do it right now, can we, real quick? No. No, not one last shot. If show. I could, what I would. What about would, a DDP bend over stretch over yeah. the deal? This one of those little stretchy things, you know, a little, just leave the them alone. Come on, Easy, get it to it. Get it to it. Okay, here we go. That's that's close. It's close. Keep to going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, all right, guys. Thanks for coming down. Thanks for having us.